Hi there, I am Hermano and welcome to the channel. As you probably already know, Microsoft Outlook is a fully featured desktop email client. It is packed with tons of features to help you manage your mail, contacts, calendars and tasks. One very cool feature is delaying the delivery of an email. For example, you can prepare an email before finishing work and have it sent automatically at a specified time. It is basically the equivalent of schedule send in Gmail. Let's have a look at it. So I'm going to go open Outlook here, create a new message. For the demo, I'll just send it to myself. And then I could put in the subject and write a message, but I just want to show you the option here shortly. So I'll go here to the options menu, click on the three buttons here, and then click on delay delivery. Now we have several options here. The one I'm looking for is do not deliver before. So this one is already checked because I tested this before. If it's unchecked, just give it a click, select your day. And for example, I'm going to pick on Monday next week and it has to go at nine o'clock. There you go. Close. So now if I would click send, this message will be delivered next Monday at 9 a.m. But there is a catch. This will happen only if Outlook is open and running and connected to the internet. Otherwise, it won't work. So how can we change that? At this point in time, Outlook doesn't really offer a send later feature, but we can trick that. I'll show you how to do that. Let me close this message here. And you're going to go to File, Account Settings, double click on your account. And you see here, we are right now in cached exchange mode which basically means a copy of your inbox is always in Outlook so that you can work on your mail also when you don't have any connection. And as it says here in the bottom of the window, we are connected to Exchange. Now for the delay delivery to work when Outlook is closed, we'll have to change this. So what I'm gonna do is I uncheck this box, click Next, click Done, close the window. I'll have to restart Outlook for this to work, so I'll just close it and restart it. And there you go. Now, there is a change you can see already here in the bottom. It, it doesn't say anymore connected to Exchange, but it says online with Exchange. So now if I would go and create a new message and I'll put in the same options, uh, delay delivery, well, is still on the 23rd, so I'm going to change this again on the 28th at 9 o'clock. There you go. Close. Now, if I would click send here, the message is actually going to be sent to the Exchange server. So you won't see actually anything happening at the moment here in Outlook. And if you go on Outlook on the web, you won't see your message neither. But you have to trust the message is in the Exchange server. And you can be sure next Monday at 9 o'clock, the message will be sent. So this is how you can trick the system for now. Like I said, it's not a real schedule sent, but it's close to it. Maybe Microsoft will implement this feature in the future, but right now this is how you can use it. So I'm going to close this window. Don't save the changes. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this tip. And if you want to see more, make sure you like this video by clicking the like button below and subscribe to the channel if you want to be notified of future videos. And if there is anything specific you want me to cover in G Suite or Office 365, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching guys and see you in the next one.